Hello, I'm Dr. Wally Bartley, and I'm the Associate Dean Undergraduate in the Faculty of Health Sciences at Ontario Tech University. And today I'm going to be talking about what is public health. We hear about it all the time today in the news, on the mass and social medias, because of COVID-19. And because of that pandemic that is happening globally. Well, how are we preparing our students to deal with outbreaks? and manage large-scale emergencies and disasters such as COVID-19. So in this particular video, I'm going to provide you with a brief overview of how we actually prepare our students to deal with outbreaks. In this case, it's a food poisoning outbreaks, but the theory, the applications, the way that we do contact tracing, the epidemiology, uh, the social control measures that are put in place, all apply and are relevant to other forms of outbreaks. So let's begin with the definition of what public health is exactly. Well, public health is really a holistic and evidence-informed discipline that really wants to promote, maintain, and restore health across the entire lifespan and improve individuals, families, communities, or entire populations' quality of life. And we do this through various health promotion and prevention interventions, as well as a variety of primary health care initiatives, activities, policies, and legislations. I would also argue that public health also involves the art and science of persuasion. Indeed, think of COVID-19. We have to use the best available scientific evidence, for example, on social distancing, and inform individuals about this in order to prevent infection and transmission of this virus. We also have to persuade individuals to self-isolate should they travel abroad or come back from abroad for 14 days. There are several career opportunities in public health, and here are just a few. In this particular uh, experiential learning exercise, we had medical laboratory students partake uh, in, in this exercise, as well as public health students. We had various faculty with a wide variety of expertise. We had epidemiologists, uh, public health uh, specialists, uh, individuals who were nurses, uh, all come together as, as part of this wonderful learning experience. So in this particular uh, slide, we see some public health students here and some med lab students in the background working together to solve a food poisoning outbreak. Here we see some med lab students who are actually analyzing samples and they would communicate the findings uh, to the chief uh, medical officer of health that was designated here. Here was a public health student in this particular scenario. And um, just like we do for the Minister of Health and Long-Term Care here in Ontario. In this particular case, the food poisoning culprit was salmonella, which is a common source of bacteria, uh, which, which leads to food poisoning. At the end of this experiential learning exercise, uh, all med lab students and public health students who successfully completed their learning outcomes uh, were awarded a certificate. I encourage you to visit our Faculty of Health Sciences website, which provides additional information regarding our various programs that we offer at Ontario Tech University. Thank you for listening.